I'm James Madi Rieko. Uh, I'm a South Sudanese. I'm 25 years old. Uh, I'm a married person with one child. Uh, I'm a footballer. At the same time, you know, I'm a blog leader. Again, I'm a youth leader. I'm living in Kakuma, refugees camp. I'm living in Kakuma 4, Zone 3, Block 5. When I was a very young boy, so I start football like um, I was making some rabbit papers, uh, I used to, to make using what is called match box. I do welding. I was playing football myself because of, of interest. Because before I don't know, I was playing without shoes. I was playing without jersey. I was playing without even good balls. So when the Rossi come in, so it has provided me with with those facilities. It was provided me with shoes, provide me with soft, provide me with the jersey, also provide me with balls. So, uh, so as from there, the moment uh, I've been trained, I've been for everything. So I become perfect. I can also, I'm, I was playing there. Uh, even uh, I feel that I can meet my dream. And despite that, I'm in Kakumu. I can also, when I can also dream that one day I can be like Cristiano Ronaldo, can be like um, Suarez. Can, also, I can be like Vivian Drogba. I really gain knowledge. I become strong and I become very, very, very uh, capacity building and also I experience a lot. You know, football has made me to, to be famous when I pass around People say hi to me, children are coming to me, say Madi, Madi, I become even myself, I become happy, it will motivate me. So and all this, for me to be known, I can only know DRC is an organization contribute to me a little, a little bit or higher bit, because it has shown me as a, that I am, a, I am a person through the sport that she has been in power and this one was make me to be famous in the community. I work for DRC. Uh, before I worked for DRC, I was, uh, I was just as, as myself. So I was, uh, I was like a DRC client. I was a DRC client. But when DRC advertised some life skill training, resilient training, leadership training, I attend those training and I do those training very well. So from there, those training are the one make me to qualify to get a job in DRC. Other people like you, that's why now they direct me to come for this training to empower others, train others. You. And also, I teach what is called life skill. Uh, I teach resilience, and also I teach uh, leadership skill. So those skill, those tr trainers, trainees, which I do train them. So they, when they went to community. They have carried my name and say that I'm training people good way. So we deserve this guy to become a leader because DRC has trained him enough and also the knowledge that she get from DRC, it can also give him to us, it can be an advantage to the to the community. So I have, I have life. So the moment I have life, so they have selected me. So they have identified to me their problems or their concerns. So those concerns, those issues, I normally handle them differently. You you may find there is a certain problem in this football field, like Zone 1, Kakuma 4, Zone 1, football field, people are quarreling, are fighting. So I rise there quickly and solve that case. So those, those words, they are the ones makes me, make the youth to select me, because I encourage them into their nearest future, not just to encourage them to do the bad things.